Right, and we are about to start our fifth fight of the night. Cody Gutierrez, Ryan Waterland. They look ready to go. So real quick, Leslie, to clarify what happened in that last fight, he, he hurt his neck really, really bad, uh, did Andrew Silva. Something popped in his neck and he couldn't move his head. That's why he tapped. Ah. And here we go. So, oh, what a right hand oh. by Irish Ryan Patrick. And Gutierrez is able to fight back and get a takedown. Wow, what a right hand right off the bat. Straight right hand down the pipe. He's in a good spot right now. At least he's on top. He's got a chance to get his brain clear. He doesn't have to worry <laughs> about getting punches from the bottom. Man, that was a quick start, though. Looks like it was going to be rough. So both these guys in black trunks now on top is Irish Ryan Patrick. Now he'll posture and immediately rain down blows. This is a striker right here, Leslie Smith. I like the way he did that neck grab. I think those are underused. He definitely needs to keep his head up, though. If he's reaching out, he doesn't want to be looking at uh, Gutierrez's <laughs> I've got to tell you, look at Patrick, head straight up, chin out, hands to the side. This is a typical Irish pub fighter right here, Leslie Smith. That is exactly <laughs> what he was acting like, just walking in with his hands down. No fear, no respect at all for the power, and he may pay for it, Leslie. Instead, he, he goes uppercut right, and look at this guy. He's stalking him like Michael Myers. And I'm not sure that Cody Gutierrez knows what to make of Irish Ryan Patrick right now. It, it, it can be tough. It can be tough to deal with someone who's acting completely different from anybody that you've ever seen before. But I think those knees are a good idea. I, I'd like to see him take advantage of, a, of the hands down. I'm seeing the old school. Every time a punch is thrown, Patrick lowers his head to let it get hit in the forehead, almost in an attempt to break the hand of Cody Gutierrez, who is now unloading. Gutierrez is teeing off on him right now. One of those punches hurt him, Leslie. Oh, oh and man. then he came back for the almost the knockout. This. Unbelievable <laughs> fight. I Good mean, job by Gutierrez holding him down so he can recover. Wow, I am blown away by Waterland's, uh, he, his whole manner. Unbelievable, he, he, takes a, he takes a couple big shots, Leslie. He looks like he's hurt. He's got his head down. Look at him still. And he's just walking <laughs> around with crazy eyes looking at Gutierrez still. So, so he looks like he's hurt. And I don't know if you remember the fight with Scott Smith, who's out of here in Northern California. He looked like he was hurt one time, threw a right cross and knocked his opponent out in the UFC. And right here, I don't know if he was playing possum, Irish Ryan Patrick, but he just came out and threw a left hand that just dropped Gutierrez. Yeah, he's a really hard fighter to read. He's definitely got his own personality in there. Yeah, and for the first probably minute and a half, he was walking around with his hands at his side. What do we got? Something going on in the corner here. Uh, I think they're just doing their standard thing. Those are, um, 
Are those padded undershorts that Gutierrez has? Sliding shorts. Sliding shorts. play baseball. Ah. This is a, a, a heck of a fight. I mean, something's wrong with the door here. We have just about everything go wrong that could go wrong here tonight. Let's just <laughs> so I think that if Gutierrez can get a little bit more accurate with his punches, there and were it, a couple times when he had Waterloo. Something's going to happen here. Fanchier's going to stop the fight for a second because that tape is going to have to be fixed. Oh. But he gets dropped again, does Gutierrez. Dude, Gutierrez just keeps coming back. Now, you see that long tape hanging off the left hand of Gutierrez. If Fanchier sees it, He's going to stop the action, and now eating a couple of shots is Irish Ryan Patrick. And he is. He's a pub fighter from Ireland. One of those guys that says, how hard can you hit me in the face? Let's see it. Yeah, that, that's exactly what I'm getting out of this. Oh, it looks like we're going to deal with that tape like you were talking about. Yeah, absolutely. Now, So we're going to take a minute. Usually you want the fighters to go into neutral corners. Now, Irish looks Ryan, like that's where he's headed. <laughs> Irish Ryan Patrick looks really upset that the fight has stopped. The crowd was pretty <laughs> upset. They were like, no way. I, I don't think that they realized that it was just to fix the glove, not the end of the fight. I got to tell you something, Leslie. He's sort of stumbling as Cody Gutierrez. He looks like he could be kind of out on his feet. Oh. I don't think he can take too many more. And if, I think if, if one of those big ones lands, th that might be the end of the fight. Now he's going for an arm in guillotine. He does have, you know, if I were him, I would go for a snap down and try to finish him on the ground. He gets reversed. Well, he could still. He could still. Well, out no, of it now no, is Irish no. Ryan Patrick. <laughs> I think Gutierrez should try to go for the ground, though. I'm so entertained by this fight. I have no idea who's ahead. I'm assuming that with the big knockdown that Patrick's probably be ahead. Uh, Irish Ryan Patrick, Ryan Waterlin, although he told me not to call him Waterlin. He wants to be Patrick, even though that's not his last name. But, hey, <laughs> it's his fight. Oh, man, let's see Gutierrez just start teeing off. He's on top. He's got posture. <laughs> Leslie has bloodlust. I do. That's what I want to see. That's what I came here for. And now, is it, what did we got here? Did he it elbow looks him? looks like the ref ran in to stop him from punching him on the back of the head. So we had an illegal strike to the back of the head. He's going to take a point away, maybe. No, it's one warning. One warning now for fans. Looks like it's a warning. No points taken. I have a feeling that Patrick doesn't really care if he hits him in the back of the head. Just, a, just an, a, an observation as this fight continues. Once again, they're both in black, but the blue trim is Irish Ryan Patrick. The red trim, Cody Gutierrez from Manteca. Ten more seconds. Now, I got to say this. Irish Ryan Patrick is not the most technical fighter. He's taking a lot of shots. Dude, I, I just don't know. I don't know this. which we got way a problem to go here, Leslie. Oh, what, are they going to fight? Uh, it looks like they want to fight now. <laughs> Um. So here's the situation. I'm, I don't think that Ir Irish Ryan Patrick is the most technical fighter in the world. I don't think he's got crisp strikes, but I'll tell you what, he comes right at you, he eats anything you put toward him, and then he just throws heavy, heavy leather trying to knock your head off. And Gutierrez is a little bit stymied by the style. He is a little bit stymied by the style. Gutierrez has some skills. He's got a lot of reach. And he, he's been doing a good job at throwing things. I'd like to see either one of these guys just start throwing straight down the middle and then mixing up their strikes with a takedown. So what we had at the end of the round there was a couple guys threw, they both threw extra punches, and then they wanted to get into a fight, and I guess somebody told them, hey, you're already in a fight. Just give us a second, and we'll let you hit each other. <laughs> now we've got the ice bag out over on Irish Ryan Patrick. Killa B is in the building, blown out knee and all. <laughs> Still the toughest guy at the table. All right, so fans cheer now. Patrick's shoulders are coming up and down, as are Gutierrez's. <laughs> Who's winning this fight, Leslie? Do we know? It is so hard to tell because uh, um, Waterland keeps doing this, what he's doing right now, where he pretends like he's hurt or he really is hurt. I don't know. I can't tell. It's been stopped. So that now, is the end. So now here's the situation, like you were saying, if he was playing possum, he went too far with it. He did go and too Fanchier far. And stopped the fight. Yeah. If he was hurt, again, the fight stopped. So now Gutierrez is all pumped up. And Michael Gilliland, who works for Camo, is trying to calm him down a little bit. And Irish Ryan Patrick just looks like he wants to fight some more. 